Hey guys, Professor Bill of Comic Book University, and I'm going to explain 10 things about Typhoid Mary in about a minute. Mary Walker's first appearance was in Daredevil number 254 in May of 1988, and she was created by Anne Nascenti and John Romita Jr. Mary was born into an abusive home where her parents constantly fought. It had been implied that her father would molest her while she was still in her crib. One day, she lashed out. While it wasn't fully understood what had happened, Mary displayed several psychic abilities capable of harming others. She also developed dissociative identity disorder in the form of four distinct personalities. As a result, she spent her childhood and adolescence in several psychiatric institutes. Mary is a mutant, and it was discovered that her different personalities allowed her several different powers. The Mary personality has straight hair and is meek and vulnerable, desiring a strong man to protect her. Typhoid Mary wears dreadlocks and is always sweating and feverish. She is very sexual and can call upon pyrokinetic abilities to cause fires within her line of sight. She employs mind control and can convince people to do as she wills, induce sleep, and even convince people to commit suicide. Bloody Mary wears her hair up like a fountain. She is violent, humorless, and hates men. Bloody uses telekinesis to manipulate small items, like weapons, to attack and kill. A fourth personality, Walker, is a very neutral state. Her psychic abilities have allowed her to become imperceptible to Daredevil, impossible to track by Wolverine, and she can even bypass Spider-Man's spider sense. She's also one of the few characters in the Marvel Universe who actually enjoys the pain of Ghost Rider's pen and stare. Her powers seem to be greatly amplified when she took the identity of Mutant Zero, though she could only operate for one battle before needing to be taken off the field. In any form, she's a martial artist and a weapons expert who can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anyone. Mary is an enigma whose fractured mind makes her a complicated character. And that's 10 things about Typhoid Mary in about a minute.